All right, so the first thing we have to do is bake out the model, okay? And we bake out the model by using ambient occlusion. Ambient occlusion is the ability to have all the shadows, cracks, and crevices shaded for us. That way when we do add some texture to it, it'll look shaded even if it's not being rendered, okay? And that's very important to know that because in games, you have to make it so everything looks a little bit more rendered than it is. So all the detail in the cracks and crevices show up, but the, but the thing is, I don't want to hand paint that detail in because hand painting it is amazingly hard sometimes. So what we're going to do is rely on a thing within Maya under rendering. We have this lighting batch big mental ray square box. Now there's really not a whole lot of setup on the scene for this. Um, later on there will be, but for right now, what I want to do is bake selected objects, bake the texture, uh, multiple objects, sure. Use bake set override. Then I'm going to switch this to occlusion. Okay. That's what it is. It's bake occlusion. So I I name occlusion OCC make sure this is the correct f number so 4096 by 4096 okay tiff 8 bits number of samples 4 and then I want to bake to one map now it's very important that we do this next step file project set. Now what I have is a folder with that OBJ in it so I'm just gonna hit set. The folder can be empty except for the OBJ. You should be have the OBJ in there. Does it really matter? No, it's just good proper uh, structure that's all. So I'm gonna save the scene and it's gonna be saved within that actual project. Okay. Alright, now this process can take up to 30 to 40 minutes depending on the, p the speed of the machine, the complexity of the bake, and how many edge loops and polygons and all those things come into effect though but usually it takes about 30 to 40 minutes all right so when you hit convert you're going to see a little bar down here and it's going to do its little number and I'll meet you back in the program after it's done okay so that is how to set up a batch bake using ambient occlusion in Maya please meet me in the next video